Hey, what's up everyone? Today I am making a buffalo chicken dip and let me tell you what, it is stupid good. Mmm. You're gonna wanna make it. Okay, so the first thing that I have going on is in my pan over here and I have like a tablespoon of bacon grease and a tablespoon of butter. Of course you can use all butter if you want to, but if you want to make it awesome, go ahead and use half and half, like me. Go ahead and mix that around a little bit. My kids are half and half. <laughs> Your kids are half and half. I know. <laughs> Our kids are half and half. <laughs> Half bacon, half butter. That's right. Tablespoon of butter, tablespoon of bacon grease, tablespoon of garlic. Get it all in there. I know not everybody adds garlic in, and you don't have to add garlic in. You can keep this recipe super basic if you want to and be like, what? Cream cheese, yeah, it'd be basic. Cream cheese, Frank's Red Hot Chicken, done, oven. But, you know. We're going to be extra. Crispy. We're going to be extra <laughs> for her. <laughs> I thought crispy because chicken. I'm adding in some uh, green onions. I don't know, I chopped like three. Let's call it three. I saved the very little cutie tops, the dark, dark green part for garnish at the end, right? But the rest of it is going in. Stir! Get everything nice and yummy and coated. I'm not going to add any salt. Like normally right now, I would tell you to go ahead and add in some kosher salt because you salt in every layer when you cook, right? You're with me? We salt in every layer. Not this time because there's salty stuff coming. And that bacon grease has salt in it, right? You should put pepper though, right? Pepper! Should we do black or white? One of my favorite comments that I've ever gotten on any of my videos is on my Cajun seasoning. And somebody put in the comments, what if I don't have... Yeah, I think they put, what if I don't have white pepper? And then somebody commented back to them, then you're a racist. <laughs> it just made me laugh. I thought that crap was funny. Well done. Well done. Well done indeed. Well done on that. I'm going to just hit it with a little bit of pepper. No certain amount. The amount you like. Black pepper too, did you say? I did. Black pepper. Just a little though. I, I feel just a little. Right? Start. Let that cook for a second. Alright. That's ready, right? So I'm going to go ahead and I have Frank's red sauce. I did... <clears throat> Third cup. I have a third of a cup of Frank's sauce. Why use Frank's? Because Frank's is delicious. Everybody uses Frank's. Shouldn't that be original? Daddy likes Frank's. I think it was the, the original. The I thing. feel like it's the original, but I don't know like for sure. <laughs> All right, so we're stirring this. I'm gonna. I'm going to turn the heat down just a little. Um, I'm gonna turn my heat down to four and a half, though. So. I'm going to just give this a little stirry poo. We're just going to get it nice and warm going through. And then I have some other goodies that we're going to add in. So I'm going to grab them. Save some of those chopped green onions. Right, the little pretty ends. Saving these for garnish. Get all that. Garnish, poo, garnish. Okay, so I also have a quarter teaspoon of celery salt. Again, totally optional. If you want to put it in, put it in. You don't want to put it in, do what you got to do teaspoon and a half of Worcestershire sauce. I actually googled a while back and watched a video that like a speech coach therapist person tells you how to pronounce it and I watched it 800 times but I was saying it wrong before that. I was saying like Worcestershire. 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 Hold on one moment Leisha. If I were to take one more step, it'd be the furthest. <laughs> it'd be the furthest away from the Shire I've ever been. This is the worstest Shire I've ever been this in my life. Worst this is the worst Shire. Shire away from shit I've ever been in my life. The situation shit and shook. Eight ounces of cream cheese. Heat's off. So we went and saw Lord of Heat's the Rings. Off. Heat's off. We went and saw Lord of the Rings. And some people were drinking before they went in. Some people. Not us. And were slightly obnoxious in the theater. It was us. And, yeah, we could not shut our mouths. Dude, they just oh say so much gosh. stupid crap in the movie. And don't get us wrong, we love the movie. Love Lord of the Rings now. Love it. Now. Sober. Yeah. 
But at the time, it was so funny, and we just made fun of everything. Like, there's so much to be made fun of. Dude, because he's like... He's like... If I take another step, I'll be as far from the Shia as, as I've ever been. And then the rest of the movie, I was like, no, no. Now, now, no, now's now. the furthest. No, now, no, now's the first now's I've ever been. Now's the furthest. Now's the no, furthest no, 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 I've no. ever been. And speaking Elvish, where? Uh huh. <laughs> because I can speak Elvish. Uh huh. Long uh -huh. Cadillac. Long Cadillac. Uh huh. That's also a bad to Southern preacher. <laughs> I'm doing the, the, the what's it? The well, swim. That's, that's Elvis. That's my man. <laughs> All mm -hmm. right. Moving right along on that note. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> you do it better. Uh, take this off the heat, but do it with a pot holder, because it's gonna burn! I was trying to put the gear dog. All right, so I got that cream cheese all mixed in, and I'm adding in my sour cream. I'm going to put a half of a cup of sour cream in there, just to get it extra creamy. Yummy! Who doesn't want a little extra creaminess? Mm-mm-mm. That's what I'm saying. Me too. Me too. Stir it in. Might as well add our ranch too. Probably double stir. Uh, you look delicious. <laughs> it's all right. It's all gonna come together, sexy. Don't even worry about that. Don't worry about the individual parts. It's gonna be delicious. All right. Stir. 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 Get it all mixed it together. It's not going to be super deep. Super deep. Like the deep south. I don't know why it came out like that. It just did. Mm. I know. It's not going to be a super deep dish here. You could add more chicken. And by the way, you don't have to use canned chicken. You could also use like rotisserie chicken if you just happen to have gotten one of those the other day or like one that you baked at home or whatever you have going on. But we're just throwing together a little, we're just throwing together a little appetizer. That's what we're doing. Right? We're going to go ahead and get it stirred together. What I need is more cowbell. Yes. <laughs> All right. Scrape your sides. Yeah. Can't help it. Gets me going. <laughs> All right. Smooth it out. Not for the reaper. Don't fear the reaper. Uh, this is. Mm -hmm. Delicious. 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 <laughs> He's licking a spatula like a little kid. Mm -hmm. This is white cheddar, and we have, we didn't really measure, like a cup and a half cup. However much it is, it's just going right here on the top, and this is going into the oven at 375 until it looks delicious. Ready? Set. Delicious. <laughs> it's funny. It never stops being funny. Oh god. Oh. Ah. Mm. This weighs a thousand pounds. This oh. is so we're all clear. Why are you so honey? Because I'm made of tungsten. <laughs> made of iron. Not right. bad. Iron. Iron. So this spent like 10 minutes ish inside of my oven at 375. And then I lifted up the shelf and I put it under the broiler on high for a minute. And it is like, ooh, what? It's all golden and crisp and ready and delicious. So let's give it a taste. Yeah. A little dip. Mm. I like the I like the crackers with it. I haven't tried the other options, but I like crackers with everything. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> He's talking about me. <laughs> I'm the cracker in that sentence. Yeah. My mouth is on fire. I'm such a baby. And the carrots are really good. I already tried it, like you said. You guys can control the heat. You can That's add. Bites. You can add more sauce than I did. More of the Franks, if you want it hotter. You can add the hot version. I was thinking you could go like Asian hot wing and do like ginger and sriracha and like. Asian y stuff, little fish sauce up in there. People Guess do Asian hot wings. Because mm -mm. uh -huh. it's time to get the party started. Do some hot wing sauce. Mm hmm. Yep. 
Mmm. Some lime, some jalapeno. Carrots are my favorite so far because you have the sweet and the spicy together. I think carrots are the way to go. This is spicy. It's pretty it's, spicy. It's burning my mouth, but like, honestly, I'm surprised you're still eating it because it must be freaking delicious. It's freaking. It's tasty. Y'all should make it because it's tasty. Oh. Mm mm mm. Mm 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 mm. Mm. God, the gun. That's how good it is. <laughs> yep. All I'm saying is, this is freaking amazing. If you haven't subscribed already, do it now. Check out other videos. Share stuff because sharing is caring. And I will see you in the next video. Happy cooking, everyone. Got the guns again! Sexbytesforever.com Oh! <laughs> Buffalo at the end. I like your song. Buffalish.